Assalamu alaikum. This is Yasser Ahmed, and you are watching Arabic Voice, and this is uh, Arabic for Beginners course. Uh, in our last episode, we studied uh, the word Hatha, which means this, and we studied some examples of masculine vocabulary. So we said last time Arabic has masculine vocabulary and feminine vocabulary. Masculine vocabulary requires word like Hatha, this, for it, and feminine vocabulary requires a word like Hazihi. So Hazihi uh, simply means this, but for femi feminine vocabulary. So uh, if we have a word like Maktabatun, uh, it's feminine, and the sign of feminine here is the Tamar Buta, mostly feminine vocabulary have this sign, which is Tamar Buta, so let's uh, understand it like this for now. So we have a word like Maktabatun, uh, we should use Hazihi, not Haza. I can't say Haza Maktabatun, I should say Hazihi Maktabatun. هذه شجرة هذه شجرة هذه سيارة هذه سيارة هذه مدرسة هذه سفينة هذه بنت هذه امرأة and we said last time how to uh, make the question uh, is this so and so by using a as the beginning of the sentence or had so let's practice this أهذه مدرسة؟ نعم، هذه مدرسة. أهذه بنت؟ نعم، هذه بنت. أهذه سيارة؟ نعم، هذه سيارة. أهذه شجرة؟ نعم، هذه شجرة. So this is how we answer the question uh, positively using نعم. Let's practice uh, answering the question negatively. أهذه مدرسة؟ لا. هذه مكتبة أهذه بنت لا هذه امرأة أهذه سيارة لا هذه سفينة and also as we said in the first episode, we use men to ask about human beings. So, men, men hatha, as we said last time, means who is this? And ma hatha, what is this? And here, the same thing, ma hazihi means what is this if you are if you are asking about a feminine uh, word and man has he if you are asking also about a human being uh, feminine so let's practice uh, at first ma has he ma has he 
هذه سفينة ما هذه هذه مدرسة ما هذه هذه سيارة and also uh, asking about humans من هذه هذه بنت من هذه هذه طبيبة من هذه هذه امرأة من هذه هذه مدرسة من هذه هذه مهندسة Okay, so uh, in this lesson we studied uh, the word هذه and we said we use it for feminine vocabulary uh, objects or human beings like هذه مدرسة or هذه امرأة and we studied how to establish and how to form the question like what we did last time so I hope you understood uh, this lesson and uh, stay tuned for our next lesson wa assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah